with John and Adrian. <laughs> g- g- g'day guys. I've just been down to uh, Coles, New World. Picked up a delicious little uh, <laughs> blue throat brass. We're gonna have a crack at cooking one because we've heard tell that they're not too bad. As soon as we've thrown about 57 of them back in the ocean, we're gonna just try cook them on. 80's had a go at gutting it and getting the head off. I'll see if I can get some fillets off it and we'll cook it up and see what it tastes like. Yum, yum, yum. Maybe. No, oh, did you Google this before you oh, mate. decide to do this video? What's Google? Stubborn stone, stubborn little backbones in around here. Mm. Johnny the fillet master. Look at Johnny, that. I was thinking Johnny the butcher. Yeah, that's what I was gonna be as a butcher. Back in uh, high school. Mm, I'm fucking slide this in under here now. Garbage fish, mate. Yep. Have that back. A little bit of meat there, mate. We've got zero bones in there, but one bone. Two bones. And some sashimi, mate. Yeah, no thanks. Just so slimy. Yeah, I'm gonna need the fingers out, I think. Got the new $4 Jarvis Walker fishing gloves on, available now at Kmart. Not a sponsor? Not a sponsor. Damn. They'll come knocking on the door. Don't know. I don't know yeah. who would want to sponsor this shit show. <laughs> <laughs> and they see this video that they'll come knocking, mate. Johnny's cooking masterclass. Look at that. Look at that rotten skin, mate. Blech. That's not too bad, little um, chicken tenders. 
It's better than the other one. Give them a little clean up. And we'll be back in a minute with the frying pan, eh? Mm hmm. Aidy can clean this mess up while I'm in there washing these. Yeah, not. Alright. We're gonna, we'll cook one just purely plain, see what the flavour's like, and then this one will absolutely smother in garlic to see what that's like. I reckon I'll just cut them into little chicken McNuggets from McDonald's. $10 for 24 nuggets. Smells too bad? Butter. <laughs> it smells like butter. It's not going to take too long to cook. Yeah, I like the crispy. Oop, falling apart now. Crumbly, mate. I feel like doing it when it was cold. Cool. Alright, dig in, hey? Yep. Taste test of Johnny's blue throat. Oh, there goes my towel. Yeah, bit of pause, mate. I'll give it a minute to cool down. Yeah, I like the crispy. Oop, falling apart now. Crumbly, mate. I feel like doing it when it was cold. Cool. Alright, dig in, hey? Yep. Taste test of Johnny's blue throat. Oh, there goes my towel. Southern lot here down at Semaphore Jetty. We're going to um, chuck in this pan here with a bit of salt and pepper and garlic. And then we'll do a taste test at the end. Marvellous. This one's going to be the winner. It's 
Oh, smell it now. That's pink Himalayan. You wait for it, mate. Here's the money shot. Smell that, yeah. Garlic. Mm hmm. Garlic on anything that smells better. Oh, mate. Garlic on you. That's good. <laughs> Good, isn't it? Yeah, your neighbours have come out. Yeah, mate. I heard them say, what does that smell? Beautiful. Try a little bit of dirty rock fish, mate. <sighs> what do you reckon? Give that a minute for it. Yeah, them and then put them both on and then do a taste off. What's going on here, Adrian? This is your plain blue throat wrasse. Just butter. Doesn't look very impressive. This has got pepper, salt and garlic on it. I'm going to do a taste off and see how we go. I'm just going right. to run a little bit down the jetty here. Mm hmm. That's all right. Hey. Hey. Ugly looking rockfish, but it don't taste too bad. It's not a like a strong gamey flavour, it's just a pretty mild. Ah. Yeah. Wow. Be, start holding on to a couple of them. They'll go awesome in a curry or something, because it's not like a Strong flavour on its own. You feel it? Down at 7480. This is the garlic. Mm. That's so much better, isn't it? It's not a bad fish at all, man. Mm. Who's what? Smashing it. Ah, oh, you gotta try. Some bone? Yeah. Oh well. I bet enough to find them. Not bad, man. Right. If it was the end of the world, then all you have is a fish and rock. Yeah. Fish, fish and rock. Or you fish and survive. Mm. <coughs> um. There's big west fish, eh? Mm. Um. <clears throat> out of ten, what do you reckon, Adrian? Ah. Uh, say if King George is a ten, then that would be about a six, seven, eight. Yeah. Six to eight. Uh, it was just pretty plain, nice juicy, wasn't dry like a like a salmon or something. Nice juicy flesh, not overpowering in flavour. Mm -hmm. Awesome in the curry, I reckon. Mm -hmm. Johnny's cooking adventures. All right, see everyone down at 7-4. Good luck on the jetty. <laughs> see you guys. <laughs>